I am scared because, you know, I have choice specs. Maybe I should go in there with Life Orb, but I just feel like with Life Orb and Light of Ruin doing the damage, I'm going to lose AZ's flow at before this bitch even gets to put any work in. You know what? We'll try. We'll try choice specs and then we'll try Life Orb and we'll see which one works out best. Now, Mega Blastoise. This is a very interesting set that I want to try out because Mega Blastoise will be one of the strongest Pokemon to have Water Spout and at max damage it'll be it'll be dominating stuff. So you know what? Water Spout's a must. Water Pulse? I don't know. I just do not know about having Water Pulse on here. I don't know. Let's just get rid of Water Pulse. You know what? And we'll see. We'll see how it works out. Dragon Pulse, Ice... Wait, so we have Water Spout, Dragon Pulse, Dark Pulse. Dragon Pulse I want. But then again, if we have Dragon Pulse and Ice Beam, Hmm. Nah, we don't need Ice Beam with Dragon Pulse. There's no need for that. There's no need. Especially when you consider Mega Launcher. There's no need for the Ice Beam whatsoever. Yeah, I think we're good here. Yeah, man. The coverage that Mega Blastoise has when it has Water Spout, Dragon Pulse, Dark Pulse, and Aura Sphere, the coverage is just... It's, it's, it's some of the best coverage I've ever seen. <sighs> Wish I had a Ghost Move, but you know, whatever. Water Spout... Dragon Pulse, Dark Pulse, and Aura Sphere. That works out pretty well for me, I think. That's that's fine for me. You know what? That's that's gonna work. Let's see. Um Electrovire now. Um that's good. This is gonna be our physical attacker, and this is going to be where we really have to put some serious thought into. Because uh, Mega Blastoise with those moves, I think. Hmm. Water spout, dragon pulse, dark pulse, aura sphere. Will there be anything that I can't check here? No, I think I'll be good. Alright, so now we have to focus on having Electrovire to cover to cover up the stuff that really needs physical moves. So, I mean, we're going to need a physical fighting move, that's for sure, you know, just to handle any blissies. But Hammer Arm on him just seems so... bad. We're going to keep Dick Break. Yeah, this seems simple enough, you know what? We are going to go for, um... Wild Charge, no Hammer Arm. Rock slide, thunder wave, no, th no thunder wave, no thunder wave. We ain't doing none of that. We ain't, we ain't doing none of that. Dick break, earthquake, thunder punch, low kick, no low kick, just straight dick break. This is the tough one now. We have fire punch, thunder punch, and ice punch. We have earthquake, dick break, rock slide, wild charge. Wild charge is a must. Hmm. I'm thinking that we should just put freaking Fire Punch on this guy because, no, no, we should get rid of Fire Punch because if we have Bolt Beam on this bitch, we have Thunder, we have Wild, we don't need Thunder Punch, we have Wild Charge. We have Wild Charge and Ice Punch together that technically counts as Bolt Beam combination, so the coverage that Electrovire is going to have is going to be crazy. That's why a lot of people put Expert Belts on Electrovire because, you know, that bitch does damage. Hmm. Because it can hit a lot of stuff with super effective damage like this, you know? It can. Bolt Beam together with um, Brick Breaker and Rock Slide, that'll do a lot. But what about Earthquake? We, we, we gotta have Earthquake. Which means maybe we just can't have Brick Break. But Mega Blastoise has Aura Sphere, so we have really no... No, because Blissey. But Blissey will get hit hard by Wild Charge either way, and Brick Break will do pretty much the same damage, so it doesn't really matter, really. Yeah, we don't really need Dig Break. It'll be better to have Earthquake. So we have Wild Charge, Ice Punch, that'll be good for Bolt Beam, and then Rock Slide and Earthquake. This seems like it works pretty well to me. It seems like it's gonna work. And um, let's give this bitch um, max speed, plus speed. So I guess I'm gonna be Jolly with 252 attack and 252 speed. And let's make sure that we give him a life for it, because we need this guy to have as much damage as possible since he's not going to be adamant. And Mega Blastoise, you're, you'll just be plus special attack. And um, you'll be 252 special attack. And I'll put the rest in HP, just because, you know, it's not going to be fast. It'll be meant to take it. It'll be it'll be it'll be trying to take hits. 252 HP. And plus, I want to stay at full HP as long as possible 
or at least in the green of HP as long as possible since I'm going to be using Water Spout. So this works out great for me. I need to make sure that Mega Blastoise has as much HP as possible. I'm feeling good so far with our choices. I'm feeling really good. Earthquake, Rock Slide, Wild Charge, and Ice Punch. That sounds good for me. One watch of five. Hitting, hitting, hitting on the physical side with those moves. Has a Life Orb. Max Speed. Jolly. It should be great. So now, we are going to try our weird ass Heat Proof Bronzong. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. Stealth Rock is an obvious choice here. So um, we're going to go with Stealth Rock. Rain Dance would be too impractical. And um, with Gyro Ball, we will be... With, without Gyro Ball, we'll be set up bait. But um, let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I got to have Toxic on there. So you know what? We're going to come in here with Reflect. Light screen. Maybe we'll change it later on depending on what we run into, but that's going to be the way that has to go down. And, um, oh yeah, Electro Bar, you're also going to have um, uh, Motor Drive. Now, uh, Bronzong, you're going to come in there with uh, Max Special Attack Bronzong. Max Special. You got to have Max Special. I mean, Max. Max special defense, what the hell am I saying? Um, special defense. 252. Oh, whoops. Two, oh, whoops. 252. HP. 252. Special defense. With uh, freaking leftovers, of course. Mandibuzz now. Hmm. What abilities does Mandibuzz have? Let's see, let's see. Okay, Mandibuzz. Hmm. Okay, Big Pecs, Overcoat, and Weak Armor. Overcoat, obviously, that's pretty much the best move. I mean, the best ability, which is funny because Overcoat kind of sucked last gen. Okay. Overcoat. Alright, that's fine. And now you're going to be max... Wait, you're going to be plus defense. I don't know if this is the best way to go, but... Hey. We'll see, we'll see. We'll put this team in testing and we'll see how they do. 252 defense, 252 HP. You should still be able to take hits on the special side with no problem. Leftovers. So now you're going to be in there with um, Taunt, definitely. Whirlwind. Defog. No, what kind of crazy set would that be? No, you you we gotta change. What what do we want Mana Buzz in there to do? We need a phaser, so whirlwind is a must. That is an absolute. Then we need a taunter as well, just in case, you know? So you know what? Taunt is going to be on there as well. So I'm gonna remove taunt from there and put it right next to whirlwind. Since you know a phaser and a taunter. A taunter isn't as important as a phaser, I feel, but it's it's going to be necessary, especially considering... Wait, no, no, no! Why would I really need a Taunter when I have a freaking Defog? Yeah, I don't need... I don't need Taunt if I have Defog. I'm, I'm just talking about Stealth Rocks, you know? Because the purpose to me of Taunt is to be able to stop Stealth Rocks. But if I have Defog, then I can do that anytime. But if I don't have Defog, yeah, you see, it makes perfect sense to me. So yeah, that's fine. Um, Let's go in there with... Uh... File play and roost. File play and roost. Yeah, that, that sounds fine to me. Knock off. We don't have that. But you know what? We just won't be knocking people's items off. You know, you don't have to knock off their items to win necessarily. Sometimes it puts you in an even worse position. But okay, so we pretty much have our set here. And Shanty, 
Shanty has what Shanty has. You guys remember Shanty from the other battle. So, I mean, we got our Pokemon now. So, we're going to put these guys to the test in the next episode, and we're going to see what this team can pull off. It's kind of crazy, but hey, I'll see you back once, this, once these guys are totally created.